gentlemen, welcome back to another Mad Mobile video. I promised you guys while I was in Greece, I'd get you some nostalgic videos. So today we're going to be opening up a ton of packs, which is basically what I used to do like twice a week last two years ago, three years ago, maybe last year too. We're going to have some fun. So I did log into Mad Mobile and I was thinking in my head, I was like, ah, what new promos do they have? Like what kind of things? As I'm recording this, they have a chess promo. You read that shit right. A chess promo. What the fuck? Yay, chess? Are you really this brain dead? Ultimate Legend, Golden Tickets, Chess Program. What? King of the Board? Blow me. This is the stupidest shit I've ever seen. King of the Board. I wanna end my life. We're gonna open this pack because I have 50 million coins from when I like bought coins at the start of the year. And we get a Cliff Averill, sick. Do I get a chess piece too? I really want a chess piece. We're gonna hop into this gigantic pack opening. After we do the gigantic pack opening, we'll go into sets and we'll see if we got enough stuff to open up some cool sets. Because the sets are honestly a lot cooler than the packs this year. Let me show you. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. Guys, maybe I'm just having an aneurysm, but do they not have legends and sets anymore at all? Like, they literally don't have the legend program in the sets anymore? Oh my god, that's so depressing. Or maybe I'm just not finding it. All these promos in the game so shit. It's depressing. Look at all those chickens. I'll just jump off the cliff. <laughs> so here's my point. All these legend players that you see on this legends program board right here, two years ago, you could pull any of these cards at any point in any pack that you opened. Like anything that guaranteed a gold or better, you had a chance to pull one of these. Now today's video is sponsored by Alliance Heroes for the Spire. And I'm really excited to be sponsored by this because this is hands down the best RPG game on the app store right now. Alliance is a classic for a reason. You can get up to 10,000 different hero combinations that actually put your skills to the test. They have real-time PvP, there's huge boss fights that you can do, never-ending combinations of the heroes that you can pick, and massive guild battles, and it's all finally on your phone. You guys have to check this game out. In the top of the description, there's gonna be a link. You can download the game, get 50,000 free gold and 50 gems. Trust me, that is a huge advantage at the start of this game. That's it for now, guys. Remember to download this game, top of the description. Hope you enjoy the rest of the video. That's how I pulled that boss legend Steve Atwater and the 98 overall Reggie White. This year, they don't even have... I don't think you've ever been able to pull legends in packs. And I don't know why, honestly. It sucks. So, I'm gonna open all these packs. But genuinely, in my head right now, I don't know if I can pull anything. Not to discourage you, but... We're gonna see what we can pull out of all the packs I'm about to open right now. I have, I have been saving these packs up since I got this. Like, since the start of this game. But as you guys know, they really haven't dropped a lot of coin packs because they suck. Oh shit, there's a select all button. <laughs> I just started to click all those and there's a select all button. Either way, I'm going to open all of these right now. I do know that in the sets, there's a way I can trade a lot of stuff in and try and get some good stuff out. So we're going to have some fun with it. We're going to open all this stuff up and let's just pray that we can get something good. Let's do it. This is the draft boomer bus pack. It's a gold or better player, right? It could be a gold or it can be anything. I'm pretty sure. So I can even pull possibly an elite in it. So far we have pulled five gold. So yeah, it's not happening. Oh, just give me the flash. Hey, Lawrence. Okay. First elite of the day is 81 Lawrence Simmons. I don't know why I'm excited about that because I have 51 million coins, but hey, I'm just excited to see an elite. Got NFL. What is, what am I looking at? NFL draft best dressed. Somebody spent time in their day to make this card. Okay. Nick Perry. Where's Perry? Anyway, <laughs> get it? Because the platypus. Doofenshmirtz Seagull Incorporated. Ooh, we're about to have enough for an all Madden. We're about to, yup. We're 95 out of 100 on all Madden packs. And there's Morris Claiborne, another elite. Come on. Oh, we're 99 out of 100. I, it, okay, so see, I'm already guaranteed a good player because I just finished the all Madden player set. So it'll give me the guaranteed one. Tyrod Taylor here and, how'd you say that guy's name? Jeremy Parnell, I think is what that said. Pack 20 of 180. Dude, it would have been so beneficial to have this, like, select all and unclaimed, like, two years ago. But now it matters so much less because no one opens packs. Because they all cost cash. These are painful. We got a Muhammad Sanu. 85 center Ben Jones. Can I don't... I really don't think there's anything I can pull. Can I pull Ultimate Legends? I don't think I can pull Ultimate Legends either. I don't think those are in packs. I think those are sets only too, which is whack. We should be able to pull everything in packs. You know, it's kind of funny. On Madden console, you can pull any legend at any time. Not any Ultimate Legend. Like, you can't pull a full Ultimate Legend at any time. You can pull any of the base legends at any time. So I don't know why they don't let you do it on here. Probably because there's people like me with 51 million coins. 180 packs, mega packs. 
pack opening and I'm gonna get dicked like this? This is so disgraceful. 82 Ron Parker. Dude, I feel like Ali A right now. I feel like I'm supposed to be fake excited about this. DESTRUCTION! <laughs> what they've done to this game is whack. 81 Marshawn Lattimore. Actually, that's kind of good to have those. So many turning things. Here's a topper. Okay. I think that might be it for the tourney. The tourney stuff. And I probably got so much. Oh my god. I'm gonna have so much stamina. I guess they kept releasing game day bundles. Oh my god, you guys! The legendary select back! Oh! Do you guys remember? All the way back. All the way back. Christmas. Flashback to this time. Not super old, but this year's old Christmas Mad Mobile videos. I saved 10 or like 7 or something of the legendary select pack because I told you guys if I save these legendary select packs and I open them after even better legends come out, then I'll have a way better chance to pull like 95 and 96 overall legends. So now all the legends have come out. So now I'm going to get like limited Christmas legends, 95 and 96. This is gonna be sick. I guarantee there's like a 95 overall legend in all of them, honestly, because that's all the legends that are left. What do you fucking know? I can't believe I saved this, dude. Brian Erlacher, the first one. Richard Dent. See, that's like all you'd pull before is Richard Dent. Brian Erlacher, John Randall, we get the Christmas legend, Ronnie Lott, and Dwight Clark. I almost want to take the John Randall because that's pretty cool. But I'm gonna take Brian Erlacher here because I said I would get a 95 and I do. We've got another one to get. That is so sick, 95 Harold Carmichael, 95 Ogden. And we get 94 Steve Young. Again, I almost want to take Steve Young, but I think I'm going to do, but I'm going to take Harold Carmichael because he's like the tallest wide receiver ever in the NFL or something. So that's actually a really good card. So I'm going to take that. Get Richard Dent here, another Erlacher, Marvin Harrison, Randall, and another Carmichael. Oh my God. Well, I've already got Erlacher and Carmichael. Harrison, what's his stats? 93 speed. I'll take Harrison. I haven't pulled him yet. I already pulled John Randall. I didn't take him, but I've already pulled him. So yeah, we'll get him again. Will Shields, there's Harrison. Mel Renfro at a 96. That's like the highest I think the legends are is 96. 96 Larry Wilson. I'm a smart man, dude. I told you there was a purpose to what I was doing here. This pack is so sick. 95, 96, 94, 95, 95. Bruh! Holy shit, that pack was wild. Oh my god. Okay. Shannon Sharp. <laughs> Sterling Sharp. I cannot pass on my boy Steve Young, dude. I already passed him once. I can't do it like that again. But now, I'm gonna get 96 Sterling Sharp in this pack again, so it's all good. Maybe not. Oh, Kevin Williams or Ogden? I'll do Ogden now. And that's it for the legend. Those were undoubtedly gonna be the best packs in this pack opening. Those are sick. Now we have super pro packs, which are super gonna make me wanna end my life, because these are horrendous. Eight hours later. Hey, for shits and giggles, let's do the king of the board pack. Do I have enough for it? Oh my god, I do. I get an advanced pawn player pack. It's gonna be a 95. Okay, I get a 95 overall Ryan Jensen. Sure, dude. Do I get anybody other than Ryan Jensen in this? Lamarcus Joyner, and I'm out of game plans. And now I can go get another pawn. Oh, I can't because I'm out of game plans. Five minutes later. I got some extra game plans. I'm ready to get one more pawn. One more 95. Oh, it's really, it's literally Brian Jensen again. It's, it's the same guy. I want 95 Lamarcus Joyner. Don't let me down. Kendall Fuller. That's actually better. It's better than Ryan Jensen. The flashback packs. Guys, I can 100% do the 10 flashback packs video. Next video after this, I promise you will see me open 10 of these, just like the old days. Is this the good elite player exchange pack? Oh, it is. This is the this is the really good elite player exchange pack. This is the one that has like all the really high overall players. All right, sick. Well, it doesn't always, but for the most part, you usually get a good one. So we get 89 Brandon Graham in this one. Yeah, you can trade in all your 80s and get like some sick cards. 87, 89, 88. Give me a 90. Give me a 90. Oh, we got close. I got to hit a 90 overall on one of these. 88, 89. Mm, uh, oh, yes. AJ Bouye. Down at the end, I can't see him because I'm on iPhone X, but that's a 90 overall. AJ Bouye down there. Woo! 86 Talvin Smith. Where's my 90? <gasps> Aaron Donald! That's like one of the best 90 overalls. Aaron Donald, that's sick. All right, I'm going to do two more of these, and then we're going to move on to the next one. 90 AJ Bouye again? No complaints, dude. I almost want to take Taylor Luan, but I'll take AJ Bouye again. 
I remember when that AJ Bouye was like 950,000. 90 overall Johnny Hecker. First thing and only thing I opened. I love how it's him throwing the ball. Like, that's a punch. The all Madden player back. I think this is like a 100 overall player, right? I think that's what this guarantees. I'll totally take a 100 overall player. 102! Take it back. Marcus Sherrill's, and it's a punt returner. And that updates my team. So I'm like, that's kind of sick. I'm, I'm very excited about that. The huddle pack, 55 of 55. I skipped all of those to save you guys some time. I did not pull a single thing in all, like, the last 30 I opened. The final one doesn't look like it's going to have anything in it either. Follows the trend. All right, guys, I cannot end on that. Although that's supposed to be the final pack of this pack opening, I cannot end on that. This is going to be the perfect way to close out this opening. The Flashbacks player pack gives you 103 to 109 overall Flashbacks player. I guess we're just going to open it and see. I don't know what's supposed to be good, what's not. So we're going to hit the Flashbacks player pack and see who we can get wiggle. I want it to wiggle. I want to see it wiggle. All right. One, two, three. Oh, it wiggled. It wiggled right as I said that. And we get the 109. We get the 109 RG3. I wonder how many more there are because I already had the RG3 on my bench. But we get the 109 RG3. It's got to be one of the best pulls because it's a 109 overall. I don't really know if it's worth all too much, but ending the pack opening on a 109 overall, I can respect that. Thanks for watching. As always, you guys, stay tuned. Hopefully, I'll have a huge flashbacks player pack opening video coming soon. Peace out.